This is about where I fell after the snake struck. Somewhere in here, I think I landed right in that bush upside down. Anyway, hope I don't meet him again. This is Big Rock, Paris, Paris Lake State Park, south end of the, the dam. Anyway, heading toward wrap anchors where I can set up my solo rope. There I am, I'm almost at the wrap anchor. Not too bad for an old fart. Ah, dirt bags come in old sizes too. Right now I just wanna get myself safe just in case I slip. Cause if I slip up here, I'm over the edge. Now set up my wrap anchor so I can solo climb. Lock that little dude up. Got that one. Got this one. Yeah, I got my rope off. You can notice anybody that knows me. I got a bright now new shiny rope that's not all brown and dirt and aluminum oxide all over it. Lock that one off. Gonna lock this one off. I'm gonna make sure, double check everything. Make sure it's good. Uh, everything's locked off, locked off, locked off. Double back with an overhead. Now I'm ready to play the rope, throw it over the edge and wrap. Okay, take this rope here, loop it in here. Okay, now I gotta check everything out. Lock this off. Make sure I'm tied in. I'm okay, because I'm pretty good stance here. Little surprise, there's nobody here. It increases the risk, but I like the climb, so I'm going. Go give you a little idea. Shut down. Undo the beaner. Come on. There we go. My little ballet slippers. I gotta have those. I forgot that I got all hooked up over there and then forgot my slippers. So anyway, nice slippers. Had them for years. They're very smooth and very sticky. I'm into sticky. Okay, I'm getting ready to put on my soloist device which is a sort of a, a cam device locked off with a beaner and uh, the rope goes through this. Put the rope in here, pull a little spring-loaded trigger, put that in there, put this in here. Oop, can't see it, there we go. Lock it off, make sure everything is locked, locked, locked. It'll slide up, but if I fall, if I fall, then it, it, it catches me. The little cam device here that reverses and grips the rope so I don't check out. I thought maybe after all of this time, after my, uh, let's see, I'm into my 53rd year of climbing, I'm pushing 87 and I've never really documented at all any of my climbing and this is one of my favorite spots. I'm too old to do the hard stuff anymore. So I'm going to be heading up and uh, we'll see what happens. I got a nice new GoPro here and uh, we're going to see what happens. Got a new GoPro, Ed. I'm testing it out, seeing if I can I don't know, trying to get it uh, zeroed in so I don't have to mess with it, but I don't know whether it's gonna come out or not. I don't know what it's taking a picture of. There you go. Here we go. God, I used to solo this. What kind of a wacko would do that? My handhold, sometimes small, sometimes jugs. <sighs> Where am I going? Let's go over this way. 
this is the top part of Cheap Thrills, which is a nine. This isn't a nine right here, but for an old guy, it's, it's a nine. I can call him whatever I want. <sighs> Come on, baby. Here we go. Here we go. Crooks move on Africa Flakes. Ah. I gotta pay attention to my climbing. Africa Flakes. A little tricky. Just a little tricky. Hey, hey, hey. What am I doing up here? Why do I do this? Yeah. <gasps> Almost lost it. Uh, yeah, get, get, get across here and it's, I can survive this traverse. <sighs> Left flake or right flake. Down on my right from my left. Right. Right flake. Five seven ish. Difficulty. This crack's gonna run out here pretty quick. And then I have to figure out how I'm gonna. What I'm gonna hold on to. Crack's gone. Are we there yet? Uh, yeah, no more footholds. Uh, come on, baby. Hang on. Hang on. Hang on. Uh oh. pretty I'm to the right of the trough a hard one it's not really a route it's the hardest one that I've done here lately not in my career but oh crap oh Ed I'm in trouble I'm in trouble Nothing to it. When it's over, it's nothing to it. Whoa. Be cool. Don't lose it. Don't lose it. When you get in a jam, don't lose it. <laughs> <laughs> 